Hello, I'm Pot Roast Mom. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back. Thank you for being here. Today, I wanted to do sort of a tattoo style tour, but it's just marks on my cats that I love. I think it would be fun to get a real up close look at everybody living and dead. Um, and you know, those who hover in between, right? That's so fun that they're fighting during this. I love that. I love that for all of us. I think it will be especially good to get an up close look at bot roast. I think once you see her up close, you'll be like, oh, that is for sure. Definitely, definitely a toy. Um, the texture of her fur is polyester blend, but make it worse, you know? So today we'll do bot roast, bone roast, faucet, coupon, and Rocco. Um, am I forgetting anyone? Wool roast. I'll show you wool roast up close because she's one of the most stunning creatures on earth. Hey, what would it be like if you guys stopped? When pot roast died, I told my therapist like, oh, I don't ever want to get another cat because there will never be another cat that's, I mean, pot roast was quiet. She never scratched at the furniture. She didn't really do much, you know? She was a very low key chill cat. And then what I kind of did next was adopt two kittens. So, life's crazy. We'll do, we'll do coupon first. Soup, where you going la mama? Where you going la mama? So coupon has, um, no interest in being a part of this video. Coupon and Fawcett both have Siamese markings. They are not Siamese cats. That's the end of it. A lot of people think that Coupon is a rag doll. Coupon's mom was a tabby. They're both, I don't know what Fawcett's mom looked like because she was, she abandoned her. Since Coupon couldn't behave for even two seconds, Rocco's here. Rocco, my favorite thing about Rocco is everything. My second favorite thing are his front paws. They are so small. They are so delicate. They are so exquisite. Unfortunately, Rocco was declawed by his previous owner. Um, declawing cats is horrible, horrible, horrible. So many bad things can happen. You know, with pot roast bones, I think it does a good job of showing you what they take out when they declaw. So like, it's not just the nail, it's a little bit of bone and then bone shards get left in there and then it's bad all around. Rocco has arthritis because he's 17, but it's very bad in his front paws where he was declawed. Um, where you going, my handsome man? I love this stripe down Rocco's back. Pot roast had a, um, not a stripe, but a little marking that went like this. Are you so handsome and cute and I love you? I also love his giant eyes. Look at this. Oh. I, so, I also love his big old eyes. Isn't he so handsome? He's so handsome. I'm worried he's gonna jump, so I'll put him down. A lot of people um, don't like bot roast and are scared of her, but she's easily one of the best cats in this house. Top two, for sure. I should have brought Rocco closer to the camera, but I'll bring Bot Roast closer. So her eyes were painted. Um, they were actually, when she was bought off eBay, I'll put a picture. When she was bought off eBay, they were completely white, which is so scary. And her fur was um, sort of white, an old sort of white, an eggshell. Um, Fawcett has also chewed on her whiskers. She has more on this side, I think. Because far, I must said fart. Fawcett has um, eaten them off this side. She also, like look at her paws. Look at the attention to the detail. I'm pretty sure, I think I've said it before, I'm pretty sure this is fabric dye um, that was used to dye her. But the person had bought her off eBay well before pot roast died and you know sent me a message and asked for pictures of her so they could do really accurate 
like marking and dyeing, especially on the head. Pot roast had this little butterfly toupee thing. Faucet, coupon. Faucet and coupon could not behave if it was the one thing standing between them in heaven. Even then they couldn't do it. This is gonna look weird, but I do wanna show you bot roast on off switch. Um, it's right here. I don't know if you can see. There's an on, off, and try me. The try me function doesn't really work. I'll show it to you. That's it. The on function as her batteries die is working less and less, but I like to think of bot roast being sold in a store in what, the 1800s. Um, she is perfect to me. Can you hear that? Okay, I'll turn her off. But look at also look at the pads of her feet. What is that about? Pot roast also had this um, little black spot on her nose. She was so pretty and perfect. Bone roast is your classic Halloween decoration. There's really nothing to bone roast. I think from far away, people think that pot roast looks like bone roast, but cat skeletons don't have ears. Pot roast didn't have teeth. Cat skeleton feet don't look like this. But she has too many ribs. I wanna show you another living cat before I show you wool roast. Faucet has Color point markings. Fawcett is a long, a domestic long-haired cat. She is often mistaken for a Siamese cat, but she is not. She's older than Coupon, but not as big as Coupon, and so I just don't think she'll be that big. My favorite thing about Fawcett are the curls in her armpits <laughs> and literally everything else. All right, I'll show you wool roast. Prepare yourself for how cute her bottom half is. Look at these little legs. Felting an animal, oh my God, there's pink on the bottom. Felting is so difficult. You should be incredibly impressed by this. I'm impressed and then the little marking on her head and on her back, that's what her marking on her back looked like. The black spot on her nose. She's so beautiful. Look at her. I love her. She also came with a little apple hat. <gasps> is this the cutest girl you've ever seen in your life? It is. Pot roast used to sit in the smallest size of um, Amazon box. I miss her. I miss my friend. All right, we've saved the the worst for last. This is Coupon. She has a dark tail. She keeps getting this like beige color, keeps getting darker on her back. Her, when she was a baby, her little, I believe that's called a snowshoe marking, was very light and it keeps getting darker. And she gets more beautiful all the time. She is, and I would like to stress this again, a domestic long-haired cat. Coupon's mom was a tabby. Her siblings were other domestic long-haired cats. One of her siblings looked pretzel, now moss, looked so much like, and looked so much like their mom. And then the other one, Cashew, was a tuxedo cashew. If you can hear this, I miss uh -huh. you so much, and I love you. One of the sweetest things about Coupon is this little mark on her leg. I'll show you. I don't want to. Look at this. Look at the freckle. You've never seen something so cute in your life. Coupon, this is her winter coat, so her fur will get a little bit thinner in the summer. As with most long-haired cat. Oh, don't chew on wool roast. 
She also has these very sweet, 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 sweet multicolored beans. I think it bothers me so much when people um, say that soup is a rag doll is because I would never ever go to a breeder. I would never do that. I think breeders are um, the worst. That's what I think. Your breath is so rank. I can smell it from here. Coupon's breath, it could freaking cut fishing line. I'll tell you what. I love you. I love you. I love you in the morning and in the afternoon. I, me, myself, I don't have any tattoos. I've said it before, I'll say it a hundred times. I have a lot of sensory issues and so a lot of, this is gonna be a very eloquent sentence. A lot of things that touch my skin feel very bad. I'm afraid that if I got a tattoo, I would, it would start feeling bad on my skin and I would wanna get it off. Like I wash my skin a lot. There is upwards of no reason for me to be telling you. Faucet. You know when your cat dies, so you adopt two kittens, and then you take in your neighbor's elderly cat? That's hard. <laughs> Pot roast meal. Roast and toast and most and. Pot roast had the most stunning, gorgeous, perfect lower lip. Stuck out. Probably because she had no teeth, because I don't really remember it when she still had her teeth. I brushed, she got um, all of her teeth out but the four canines and then I brushed those canines for like every night for like over a year. It was, it was intense. Her stomatitis, this like, this like green slime would build up on the canines, plaque I guess, um, because of her stomatitis. I had some really teeny tiny toothbrushes but what I did for pot roast was buy gauze and just kind of gently wipe the plaque off of her teeth because her gums, they would bleed. They would bleed very easily. Um, she was very perfect. Just like literally everyone here. Anyways, thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you liked seeing everyone up close. Bot Roast, do you have any parting words? Should I scratch your brain before I go? I'm not 100% sure if that counts as parting words, but I will scratch your brain. Okay. I love you. Bye.